going to see Dr. Baines to make sure we're all nice and straight at chiropractic that we use in uh, Manhattan Beach. So, looking forward to where I get straightened out. Chiropractic. I went in there feeling uh, a little bit worse than uh, than I'd felt with a crash at the weekend, but he's got me straightened up. As you can see on the video, we were quite out of adjustment in some places, but I'm feeling uh, loose and uh, ready to go for next weekend now. You saw me standing alone without a dream in my down at the nutrition shop to see Scouser Tom can get his quick fix of protein. Protein oh. drinks for Scouser Tom. You're lifting. It's not protein, look, it's uh, the electrolytes. Hydration. We'll be on yeah. it, race prep with that inside us. The only lifting I'm doing is what I'm doing right now. See, I was never really a believer in massage and the chiropractic stuff, but it really, really does make a difference. I was. Uh, Felt like absolute shit on the flight on the way home from Pittsburgh after the, it wasn't even a big crash to be honest, you know, just a little tip off like that and landed uh, landed a bit awkward on my shoulder, but it really does make a massive difference going to uh, going to get that sports massage and then going to the chiropractic clinic. It's uh, it's made a lot of difference. I'm sore today, um, but you can definitely feel how much freer my shoulder feels uh, just after that little bit of work. So, uh, bit of a learning curve again. <laughs> So as you can see here from the video, I was coming into the corner, uh, obviously with the engine braking and heavy on the front brakes, the back end was getting loose, uh, panicked a little bit and obviously run out of road here as I went onto the grass, was still trail braking, grabbed a fistful of front brake and then washed the front. Arm automatically goes out and then there we go there is, that's just the minute there where I uh, hurt my shoulder a little bit. That was the shoulder that I've had surgery on before, so it's a little bit weak anyway. So that was the, uh, that was the crash and the problem. So back down in Temecula for a night. I've got some stuff I need to clear up at home, get a bit of stuff organized from the race from Pittsburgh last weekend and then heading back up to Manhattan Beach first thing in the morning, back up to Tom's place. Uh, him and his wife are gonna help me with the visa petition. I have to go back to the UK uh, in about five or six weeks for my visa renewal. So they're gonna help me with the, uh, with the paperwork to get everything organized, ready for, uh, ready for the renewal in London. So I'm just heading to bed now after a uh, long eventful day. So we're uh, heading back up to Manhattan Beach in the morning. Gonna try and get a good night's sleep and uh, plenty of rest. A lovely 12 hours at home in Temecula and then back to it. On my way back over to Manhattan Beach to go see Tom and Faith. Uh, they're gonna help me out with my immigration stuff. So we've got a steady couple of hour drive over there to um, get all this immigration shit sorted out. Living the dream. So we're on route to Manhattan Beach. Thought I'd call for a quick 12 minute holiday to keep this lovely Southern California tan topped up. I'll be fell jug kisses. I'll be needing stitches, I'm tripping over myself. 
Come on, dickhead! Come on! Jesus Christ. Love it getting stuck in traffic with retards like that on the phone. Get out of the way. Oh my God, should we get Starbucks? Hi, this is Carrie. Can I get any breakfast for you this morning? Can I get a large vanilla latte, please? A venti hot vanilla latte? Yeah, that's fine. You got it. Anything else for you today? And yeah, can I get a, a sausage sandwich? Sausage and egg sandwich? You got it. One sausage cheddar. All right. Venti hot vanilla latte and a sausage cheddar. It's just going to bring your total out to 850. Perfect, my love. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. What a lovely woman. You don't get that in Yorkshire. Morning guys, we're down at Manhattan Beach on the Strand. I uh, just had a walk up and down the seafront. Uh, just about to go get a coffee and then we're gonna do, go do some inversion work on the bars. We've got a little bit of an issue going on after the crash at the weekend. So we're gonna go get that straightened out and uh, see how we go from there. Go get a coffee. We've been to Pete's Coffee for a coffee this morning. We're just going to go right down onto the strand now and do some exercises to get the core working. Uh, do a little bit of stretching and get the spine straightened out. So we're just about to do a bit of spinal inversion. Uh, Dr. Bates recommended it yesterday when we went to uh, the chiropractic clinic. So we're going to do a little bit of hanging there off the bar. Um, take a little bit of compression off the spine and see if we can straighten things out a little bit. I'd have a go myself, but I think you'd have to lift me up and lift me down. Makes you go light headed. Good though, feels That's good. That's good, yeah. Fine, feels good, yeah. yeah. That's good. Got a bit of a dad bod as well. Can't you, Tom? <laughs> uh. <laughs> Winter training regime. I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. If you have, please give it a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe and also leave some comments. Thanks a lot, guys. Thank you.